Hey guys, uh, my name is Dr. Ramirez. I'm going to be your uh, professor this term for the uh, sociology of LGBT and queer communities. Um, if you are in this class, you're either registered for the sociology portion, which is um, the sociology of LGBT and queer communities, or you are registered for queer theory through women's and gender studies. So if you are registered for any one of, either one of those classes, you're in the right place. Um, I wanted to have this video so that we could go over a few things about how this semester is going to look. Um, right now, the way this class is going to be designed is going to be hybrid, which means we will meet on Thursdays in person, in class, for our face-to-face -face instruction time. But then we will have all of our assignments, every one of your assignments are going to be available online. Okay, so that's how you're going to complete all of your assignments is online. So you will be doing that when we're not in class. You'll be doing it, you know, the week prior to coming to class on Thursday. So when you go into Blazeview, it's very important that you familiarize yourself with the class in Blazeview and that the very first thing you click on when you go in after watching this video is the Start Here module. And I have that labeled as Start Here so that you guys can actually read over the syllabus and the course schedule and accessibility information, technology information, so that you can make sure that your computer, your laptop, or your mobile device actually is prepared for uh, the class as we continue to do all of the assignments online, but yet still meet face-to-face, -face, okay? Um, then there's another folder in Blazeview that says modules, and if you click on that, it's going to have five modules, and every single one of those modules is going to have all of your assignments throughout the course of the semester, and it's going to have some instructions on, you know, what we're talking about and things like that, okay? But one thing I want you guys to know is that everything that's online, it's just the assignment parts, okay? So, the instruction and the lecturing is going to be in person. It's going to be when you come to class on Thursday and we have the discussions and we're talking about what you read in the book or what crazy thing got tweeted or posted online and we're kind of sorting through that and what that means with regard to LGBT and queer theory and studies. So coming to class is really going to be the rich portion of this course of how we actually apply the information of what we're reading. So attendance is going to be for a grade. So it's very important that you do attend class. Now, while I say that, I know that this past year has been very unique with COVID-19 and the pandemic. And um, right now, I know the numbers are very, very high. I'm making this video in early January, so I know that um, numbers are increasing and it's just a very unfortunate situation. So with that stated, I, I will be utilizing Collaborative Ultra. Um, in the event that we have to go online or something happens, we'll be able to quickly, um, we'll be able to quickly to adjust because I'll have a Collaborative Ultra link already available for you in Blazeview. Um, with that also said, if for some reason you are already not feeling well or ill or um, very, very fearful of what's going to happen if you were to come face to face, um, I will allow uh, Collaborative Ultra to be used as the live feeding, you know, of me teaching in class, okay? So that means that if you choose not to come to class face to face, like in person with a face mask and social distancing in the classroom, you can log in through Collaborative Ultra and be able to watch me teach. Now, there's a couple of caveats with that. One, I'm still going to take attendance, okay? Um, which means that you will still have to be there when I take roll. And I'm going to take roll multiple times to make sure that you're there. So I'm going to probably take it at the very beginning of class, maybe in the middle, maybe at the end. I'm not going to tell you how I'm going to do it. I'm going to change it up every class because I really want to make sure that people are attending the class because... If I'm going to offer it online as well, like for you guys to log in collaboratively through Collaborative Ultra, I need to make sure you're there because the class is designed to be face-to-face. -face. So I have to still honor that because that's what this class is. It's a face-to-face -face course, which means you would have to log in during class time. 
Please understand that these lectures are not going to be recorded, so they're not something that's going to be posted later. It's going to be live feed, so you have to be there, and you have to be there when I take attendance. So if you miss any of the attendance checkpoints, you will be marked absent regardless if, say, you were there at the beginning, but you didn't say here at the end. You'll still be marked absent, okay, and there'll be no exceptions on that, okay? Um, another caveat to the Collaborative Ultra is you must keep your video camera, your, your live video camera on at all times. At any point that I see the video camera go off or I see you're not present, then I will mark you absent, okay, as if you just left class early. It would be the same as you being in class because remember this is a face-to-face -face course, okay? So um, if you have to use the restroom or something like that, then you can unmute your mic and say, Dr. Ramirez, I have a question. May I be excused for two or three minutes? I need to use the ladies' room or the men's room. It'd be just like class, okay? Um, no texting in the text box. It's going to be completely, if you have a question, you need to just verbally say it. Uh, unmute your mic and state it. Um, if we were live, you know, face-to-face, -face, you wouldn't be texting me something. You know, you would actually be raising your hand. So I wanted to go over all of those caveats because it's been so confusing and I want to be upfront about how everything's going to proceed. So you do have the option to either attend face-to-face -face, like in person or to attend face-to-face -face through Collaborative Ultra, okay? But remember, class is Thursdays at 5 o'clock, so you'll have to log in during class time. And I'm going to take roll multiple times. And um, unless otherwise stated in the syllabus, we will meet every Thursday. There will be some Thursdays we're not going to meet. But those are stated in the syllabus, and if something comes up, I will always email you or let you guys know that class has been canceled so nobody gets penalized, okay? Okay, I look forward to a wonderful semester. I'll see you guys uh, January, the first day of class, and we'll either through Collaborative Ultra or through uh, Nevins Hall in the room live, okay, face-to-face. -face. All right, see you guys then.